Jonathan is, will be our first magician performing. You may recall Jonathan, Dr. Jonathan Chen from uh, his earlier performance, um, but now he's gonna be doing something a little bit different, uh, magic, creative money management techniques. Uh, Jonathan's an assistant professor at the, in the Center for Biomedical Informatics Research and Division of Hospital Medicine. But his earliest career aspirations were to be a stand-up comedian. He hopes to share some smiles all the same. Perfect. The musical bar in this club is just getting way too high. I was like, I gotta run. I, I, I'll try something different. <laughs> you know, what, what, what'll happen is you're gonna inspire another magician to come on. <laughs> That'd be great. I've been trying to find some other people on campus. I don't even, I don't know where they are. <laughs> they're all closet magicians. <laughs> they're, they're not closet musicians, but closet magicians. <laughs> So, so Jackie will play your onstage um, kind of uh, audience member. Uh, very good. We can kind of go ahead and uh, go ahead and get started. This part isn't as um, a sort of chat, but kind of thinking about all the different things we do, managing times of uncertainty. You know, of course, shout out to nurses who actually make the hospital and the clinics run. Shout out to my wife, who is a mom, Gino. She's also a physician scientist, works in the hospital, but also trying to keep our kids alive. Thanks to my own mom, who kind of advocated and supported us all our lives and also taught us some good lessons, you know, be smart and true with your money, especially in times of uncertainty. Just some tips that I've learned that I thought it'd be, be helpful for people to um, learn as well. Like, for example, what, I, what do we have here? Um, Jackie, I've got, basically, I just got some, um, I just got some dollar bills is all it is. I got five uh, one dollar bills. And so you might not think much about that. I mean, what, you can't even buy a cheeseburger value meal with this nowadays. But the thing is, don't just dismiss it, especially in these times. You've got to keep it. You've got to save it, right? Big things come from small things. Keep your small bills, save them, invest them, and you could turn this into something more. Like, literally, you might just be able to just turn that into something more. <laughs> got a little bit more to work with. Like Very good. <laughs> there you go. 100x multiplier. That's awesome. Take so you're buying the second round. It's pretty exciting, right? Take that NIH grant committee. I don't need your stinking money. Uh, <laughs> but, uh, you know, I got to work out a backup plan in case uh, things don't work out. But before we get too excited, I mean, this is pretty exciting, right? But if I could actually just make $100 a pill or out of nowhere, uh, do you think I'd work the crazy job that I do? Actually, I probably would. I mostly do what I do for fun. But the problem is, this looks pretty real. If we were here in person, you could touch this. You could feel this. This feels very real. But the problem is if you watch closely, if you watch closely, you'll realize it was all just Oh, my God. oh wow. <laughs> That's <laughs> great. Okay. Back to work for me. Okay, okay. But all right, so we can't actually make money. That was all just illusion. We gotta find some other strategies. Jack, if you can help me out. Uh, maybe we can right. gamble for money. We're gonna gamble for real, just just for fun. And if you ever seen like a the three card Monty game, they play in the street. Like here's the money card. You pick this card, you win twenty bucks. If you pick the Joker, you pick wrong, then you owe me twenty bucks. Right, this is just we're just playing this for fun. We're not actually doing this for money. Just for example. But Jackie, just for example, can you tell me uh, where's the money card? The Queen is it in my hand or is it on the table right now? I I think it's on the table. I so um, you might think it's on the table. Oh shoot! In my hand, right? Because. <laughs> In the moment where I'm talking about this nonsense about what the mic, it's, it's, I'm just trying to distract you. Don't pay attention to what I'm saying. I'm totally just trying to distract you in that moment. I'm swapping the cards out. Now that you get how the game works, though, we're going to slow it down. I need to make this a little bit trickier, though, because you guys know what's going to happen. You can, you can follow me. So I'm going to add the second joker here. So remember, just follow the money card, which is the queen. Don't get distracted by the joker, because that's the only thing that you have to look out for. And so now think about, Jackie, where's the queen right now? On the table. Right, so on the table, it seems like it's oh, missing sure. in there, but again, you gotta watch closely, otherwise you miss the moment it gets swapped, right? Okay, okay, we'll simplify, we'll simplify, okay? Uh, let me just do two cards, maybe three cards is a little bit too much, because I know it gets a little bit disorienting, okay? All right, all right, let's, let's practice one more time. Jackie, where is the queen right now? It, it's facing down in your hand. Right, it might, well, okay, it kind of seems like <laughs> it might have been there, except if you were watching, I mean, you're... <laughs> Let, let, let me simplify. I, I don't know. It might be confusing. I'll put this one away for a second. And for reals, I, I, I really do have just two cards here. If you were here in person, we could do this. This is um, the Joker and the other Joker, right? 
Yes. Brian, are you paying attention? <laughs> Where's the pool cool. right now, Brian? In your pocket. My pocket? Why would you say that? Oh, I just, oh man. Oh, uh, that's great. <laughs> I, okay, I thought you guys were going to pay attention. Well, okay. I'll level with you. I'll level with you. Here's another lesson. Do not ever play this game for money, all right? This is not a game. This is a scam, right? Because the thing is, you would probably bet $100 the queen is on the table right now, right? Except that if you take a look, you'll find that there is no queen anywhere. Oh my because God. the guy has already put it back in his pocket, so you never even have a chance to pick the winning card. Oh okay, okay, we're going to... Slow this down. Slow down, all right? Just you can. I'm. I'm not so simple. So simple. <laughs> what card is on the table right now, Brian? I'm gonna let you answer. No, no, you, you do it. You do it. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, okay, it's the queen. You're on to it. Exactly. It is the queen. <laughs> very good. Very good. You got it. And you know why it is because. Look at this. I would never scam you in these <laughs> times of uncertainty. Let's stick together and I'll make sure you get that winning card every <laughs> single time. Oh my God, that was great. <laughs> That's great. We're going to have to good. Have you more. Good. You, you, you've got the good stick too. I think that's what one of the comments was is, uh, oh, Audrey, well done. So entertaining. Great patter too. Love this magic. <laughs> From Suzanne to Mang, a wow, with two capital W's. Uh, so From Eli Zesser, so awesome. It made me so happy you made my day. Great. And then from, <laughs> from Mani Farhadi, forget your PhD. You need to do magic for a living. Amazing. Great sense of humor. Wish I could clap out loud and not be muted. <laughs> you can unmute yourself, Mani. Uh, from Thomas, phenomenal. Yay! <laughs> from Shay, this is so amazing and hilarious. Not sure if Dr. Chen's magic or his career as a computer science PhD and internist is more impressive. Amazing talent, personality, and super entertaining. Uh, Amy Alexander, tricky, money, very nice. From Esther, uh, wow, with many W's. Oh, this is great. Uh, from Calvert uh, Lee, so entertaining and gave us lots of laughs. Thank you. From Anonymous, I demand more magic. <laughs> from, from Sandy, what? I'm stumped. <laughs> Love it. Uh, from Yi Pong, wow, with many smiley emojis. Uh, great. And then uh, from Anonymous, so wonderful. This put a big smile on my face. What a talent. Great. Thanks, well, thank you for so sharing that. I, I really hope you can come back. I want to see that in person. I, when we start doing this live, I'm ready to do This is meant to be in person. I'm meant to put the card, the money right in your hand, and uh, it's even more fun. But I don't know when that will be socially acceptable for a while, so we'll do it. <laughs>